Oh, I thought there was going to be 4, 3, 2, 1 after he posted the 5. But it, it just says 5. <laughs> I guess that means I'm probably live. Am I live? Oh, no, no, it's the 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay. Cool, is that it? Am I on? I should look. No. Am I? Yeah, all me? Alright, awesome. Hey, everybody. Talk to your human. Thanks, waiter. I'm not gonna... Probably won't interact with chat too much. I might be peeking a little bit. I might say some, some little, little something, something, maybe. I don't know. But, um, what's up, everybody? I'm Looking Toad, and I play this here Mega Man 4. I really like it. Um, it was my first speed game. Uh, one of my favorites. It's pretty much amazing. Really cool movement and stuff. Unlike Mega Man 1 and 2, where there's lots of zips and stuff, they kind of figured out how to prevent a lot of that. But we have one. We have one. So it's just lots of cool movement. You'll see. It's pretty cool. Alright, homies. I see familiar faces in the crowd. Thank you, thank you. appreciate you being here. But without further ado, let's start one. Three, two, one, go. Alright, so there's two major routes to this game. There's Pharaoh first, or Bright first. Pharaoh first is faster by about six seconds. Um, all the time saves are in the second stage, so you have to have a pretty solid uh, first... Uh, first stage, especially this screen, which I bonked the first guy. <laughs> and that guy. So, and that guy. Okay. So my strategy is to start really bad, and then just move uh, from there into being amazing. Two, four, five. But anyway, okay, so, like I was saying earlier, normally when you do bright first, you come into this with the flash stopper where you can freeze the screen, you don't have to mess with any of this. Um, very convenient. So if you have a pretty bad balloon grab, then you might as well probably be doing right first. But uh, both great routes, uh, both fun in their own respects. I think Pharaoh is really fun because of uh, the balloons, which we will see pretty shortly in the next stage. It's the main reason for coming here first, is you pick up that B that you saw earlier, which is the balloon. It's a very uh, amazing weapon that makes the speedrun very fun. Um, and we get Pharaoh Shot, which is also pretty pretty powerful in this game. And we use it to fight uh, Bright Man, even though it's not his weakness. Because if you do Bright first, you have to be you have to be fighting him with the Mega Buster, right? And that does about three damage with a fully uh, charged charge shot. But uh, full Pharaoh does three damage as well because of the glitch that you'll see me do, where you you bonk him with the overhead one a full one to throw. A lot of people who play this casually know that because it's pretty easy to discover by accident. Um, Pharaoh's a, he's, he's kind of a jerk. He'll either stand there and shoot charge shots like that, which is kind of nice because uh, they're really easy to avoid as you can see, or he'll jump around like, like a goofus like that, or he'll jump to your location like you just saw. Ideally, you want to try to lure him and keep him in the center of the screen, and that is because if you are in the center, you're in a good place to get the, what's called the magic pixel, where if you're in exactly the right spot, you zip like that to the center, and then beam off the screen. Um, there's an extra skip I could do that I didn't do, but... I won't talk a lot, Toad, then he tells the most detailed everything with passion. Did I say I wouldn't talk a lot? <laughs> that's wrong, if that's what I said. No, um... <laughs> I, I meant to say I will talk a lot. I love this game. Um... But yeah, so that's fair. Okay, so this stage is pretty hard. This is a pretty big reset point. Um, if you're going for some of the crazy strats in here. I like the music a lot. I feel like Mega Man 4 has a pretty underrated soundtrack. It's pretty much amazing. Nice. So those crickets can either jump big or small. We got big jumps. It's amazing. So that's really good. We want that. I'm gonna do my old strat in here. So as you can see, Mega Man 4 with the with the slide and the charging and everything, there's a lot of kind of fun, cool stuff. But this is where it starts to get crazy, the first instance of the balloon. Let me see if I can do it without dying. Yeah, we made it. A little chunky, but it was pretty good. Three applause. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Interact with me, Toad. Okay, Frame. I love you. You are best human. Uh, Frame's coming up later. He's gonna be running Mega Man 6. He's a really good buddy. Uh, we 
He was one of my rivals in the AGDQ 4 through 6 race, playing Mega Man 6, so have to show him some love. So how <laughs> beautiful. I'm glad. Anyway, so that's that screen. There's some interesting things happening there. Sorry, I, I, I went too, uh, <laughs> too much. Okay, I, okay. We're back to Bright Man. So, as you can see, I'm fighting him with the Pharaoh weapon. I'm trying to bonk him with the overhead one, because I get to retain, like, a full charge shot to use. Did I hit him with the single? I don't remember. I think I did. <laughs> oh no! Is he gonna kill me? Hold on. This is fine. Oh no! Okay, this is- Oh no! <laughs> okay. Alright. I'm trying out this new uh, strat that's really hot right now. It's where you uh, die to bright to uh, set up some RNG for later Square Machine. We'll talk about that. I wouldn't recommend it unless you're, uh, <laughs> unless you're a pro. I think I did. Like, I just got worried that I, I didn't. Oh, see, now I have to throw another little one. Okay. Ah, oh, wobble into him! Okay, do I have enough? Yeah, I have enough. Get him! Get him! Oh my god. What a fight. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I was about to split. Good. Because there's no splits. So anyway, that's bright. It's supposed to be a lot nicer, but... Oh well. You know all about that strat? That's what I'm talking about, man. Sometimes you gotta dial it back. To, you gotta go three steps backward to go two steps forward, you know what I mean? And that's wise. One day that'll kick in. You'll realize it. It'll just blow up your brain. <laughs> Minips, yes. Alright, so this is where you normally see the balloon for the first time. Uh, if you were doing right first. It's pretty fun. It's a pretty fun vertical. Uh, to oh! Should have done the waiter, the back D boost. But you're gonna see some. Oh, okay. Man, that turret doesn't like me. Okay, here we go. This is fine. Oh. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. It's gonna get better from here on out. You're gonna hear. You might hear me say that a lot. No. Um. So this is a pretty tightly routed stage. Um. Because you have to use your health as ammo a lot and your ammo as ammo. I'm switching to the ringman weakness right from the beginning and using it to take stuff out. Um. Having stuff. Oh, I missed my guy. Having stuff on screen causes a bunch of lag in this game. So it's unfortunate when you have that. The waiter, yeah, that's anytime you mess up, it's basically the waiter. Ooh. Ha -ha, burn. So, we're skipping the hippos, skipping these mini bosses. There's a bunch of them. We're gonna use our health to just go right through them. If you've played this casually, you know those hippos are super annoying with their missiles and stuff. It's, it's just bad. So, pretty scary screen. Nice to have a little extra health, I suppose, because bonked around a little bit coming up. Made it through okay. So let's move on over to Ring Man. Oop, grab the ladder. Here's our final Ring Man boss. He's going. Hippo, more like Skippo. <laughs> oh, these are the jokes, people. I got a book coming out. All right, time to take out Ring Man. I'm gonna do the new strat. Let's go for it. Spicy, see ya, buddy. I normally do a different strat, but I've been practicing that one. So we went for it. Throwing shade at big events, you better believe it. You gotta come with your game face on, and part of that's intimidation. You ever hear of a boxer, Muhammad Ali? Hmm? Master of the ring and master of the mind. No, I'm just, I don't know. I don't understand. <laughs> Book and toe. The jokes. The goofs. We got the goofs. We got the goofy gameplay and the goofy demeanor. Spicy fight, I know, right? It was pretty cool. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, this stage is very dangerous. Um, you can pretty much die if you do anything wrong. Um, whoop, like that. I missed a shot. I would have bonked that guy, and he would have killed me. Um, so this screen is really scary to do with Pharaoh like that, but here is the scariest part. Three, four, five. Ah, I messed up my slide. Cancel. Good thing it didn't matter. Oh, messed up my jump and my down shot. 
again. <laughs> I looked over in time just to see Sage's dust. Oh my god. It's like dust is mocking me. No. But no, we'll get it, we'll get it. Just to show you this cool part again. Thus, stage deserves to be looked over quite a bit. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, wow, 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 okay. Hey, extra life, game likes me. Okay, whoop! Oh, okay, slide. <gasps> okay! Game doesn't like me. This is spooky, you guys. Oh, okay! No! Okay, so. <laughs> We're gonna we're gonna do we're gonna pull a we're gonna concert yes exactly we're gonna pull a reverse GDQ we're gonna have a bad eight robo I'm gonna play like some of the best castle stages I've played in my life anyway let's hope I do this part good this part's really fun to do right oh, oh, oh. Woo, spooky but we got it there's no escaping dust no there isn't. Hey guys, I got a really good one. Are you ready? Are you ready? Hold on, I'll save it. It's really good. It's really funny. It's actually a little, like... Like, I don't want to, like, brag or anything. It's a little highbrow, right? Like, it's it's okay if some of you don't get it. That's fine. But I like to make the joke, so... But we have to wait until we get into the dust room. Here we go. Are you ready? Dust sucks. <laughs> oh, get it? Because... He does it with his head because he's like a vacuum dust person, and also I don't like him because he's bad. That's an original joke, by the way. Don't steal it. Okay? I came up with that. Just letting you know. The slide? Yeah. Whatever the guy. I know, it was pretty nice. And we made it. Best run ever. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> like, I start doing bad, and I'm like, well, time to break out the goofs. To make up, distract him from the bad <laughs> gameplay. <laughs> How do you ban a streamer? Okay, no, that joke sucks. I got a better one. Are you ready? I entered ten puns into a pun contest, hoping that one would win. But no pun intended. Boom. So anyway, here we are in Skull. Uh, <laughs> where this is our only zip. Are you ready? Bip! Just right through there like that. We're good. Uh, oh, I bought my guy. Go. Lots of cool balloon action. Unlike Dust, there's not a lot of ways to die. That was pretty weak. Not a lot of ways to die, but a lot of ways to go slow if you mess up the strats, which is really annoying. But the strats look really cool. Balloon stuff is always just the best. In the corner of my eye, I can see chat moving. Is it because of the joke? I saw it, like, moving a lot. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Everybody's like, no! <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Best song, yes. Skullman and Dive Man and Cossack 1 2 are known for being pretty big hits. Okay, so this is the Flash Stopper. Unlike the puny stopper of Mega Man 2, when we use this thing, it only uses a little bit of ammo, and you can still fire your buster, which is pretty much amazing. And it has a glitch where if you're sliding, the timer for it to unfreeze doesn't go down, which <laughs> it's as broken as it sounds. It's pretty much amazing. Alright, so let's go into dust. For the sake of goofs, check this out. You can try this on your own casually. Are you ready? Don't say Uncle Toad never taught you nothing. Watch this. He doesn't do anything! He reacts purely to your input, so that's kind of cool. Alright, here we go. Come on. So he gave us a pretty wacky pattern. He can leave, he can drop it right away, or he can even leave it up for like four seconds. Oh, don't split, don't split. I almost split. I was getting ready. My finger's like hovering over the button. The standoff. The tension. The drama. Skull's heart beat fast as Mega Man entered the room. You guys ever see those Hyadane videos? They're great. Alright, so let's do dive. Okay, so you can't jump out of slides underwater. It's unfortunate. You can't jump out of slides if you have your thumb on the down button. And, uh, so yeah, so uh, there's some really advanced slide canceling business you can do in here. Because I've already goofed a lot, I can't decide if I should do them or I shouldn't do them for the same reason. Oh, <laughs> uh, we'll see. Hold on. I'm not gonna do that. We'll, we'll do this. So, back when I first started, my mash is pretty bad. It probably still is, but I mash with my teeth. Shoutouts to Prizzy. Alright. 
smash success. There's a clip of it somewhere if you really want to see it. Prizzy does it too. Prizzy did it in the Mega Man 1 through 3. Relay. It's pretty cool. Bop, beep, 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 beep. Okay. You slap your knee? Good strat. I like it. Especially if you have a really good split. You're like, that's a knee slapper! Best darn Mega Man I ever played. Oh, I was one bullet shy of the one cycle. That's whack. I don't like that. Wire or bad run? No, poor wire. There's no 100% category of this game where you get the wire. Because there's no, there's no, like, there would be even if it was, like, there was a cool, meaningful way to use wire, I think. Like, I think people would do 100% um, if that were the case. But it doesn't really do anything, so you're just basically picking it up. Alright, Dive Man, he casually, he's like a nightmare, because he his attack is to dive right at you really fast. And his weakness is a Skull Shield, which will hit him, but he will just crash right into you immediately. So for a lot of people, it's, uh, it's frustrating. The task gets wire, why don't I? Because I'm not the task. No, the task does gets wire for wire skip, which is really cool in the refights. If they, they do it in Pharaoh, they get get themselves stuck in the wall and zip right on up to the boss fight. But it's like a bajillion different inputs in a very tiny frame window. So, window, yeah, frame, yeah. All right, so now we're moving on to Drill Man. Drill Man is infamous for being a horrible jerk because he'll dive in the ground and you will lose four seconds. It's very bad. Um, but as you saw with Dive, and you'll see with this stage and the next stage, Bright is just insane. The Flash Stopper is just just breaks these stages. I'm gonna use him for these, and then um, then you won't see it again, unfortunately, because it's super cool. But we're just gonna cruise through. Okay, dang, it bonked. Oh man. And coming up on a pretty annoying screen. I think it's the first frame. You have to freeze the screen, otherwise these guys open up and shoot, and it sucks. Oh, I did it! Oh, I did it bad. I done goofed. Alright, let's go. Okay. So, okay, so, like I mentioned, it doesn't unfreeze if you're sliding, so this next screen that's coming up, if my sliding's really good, it won't unfreeze, but it has to be really good. Nice! We got it! Woo! Everybody claps. Distant guy in the background goes, Hype! Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. So he will dive always right away. But whenever he dives like that, it wastes four seconds. And he can just do it whenever he feels like it. Basically. He'll either start walking, or he'll jump, or he'll dive. That was a really good fight, because he didn't dive at all, and he kind of jumped towards the center, so... Yeah, golf clap. Hi! Thanks for the good luck. I think I saw Old World Gamer. Wish me luck. It's already scrolled, but I think I saw that. Hi! You clapped, alright, we're all very nice. You gotta clap like Ness from Smash Brothers. Did you guys, did you feel the visual when I said that? He claps with his whole body, like his whole shoulders are like flopping back and forth as he's like crashing his huge palms into each other. He's like, okay, just starts bow, bow, bow. I'm like, man, that, that kid knows how to clap. He's excited. All right, so now Toad Man, best man. Toad Man did nothing wrong. He's amazing. But we're gonna switch to Bright again. I like Toad Man's stage a lot, because it's mostly just like good movement stuff. You're using Bright, trying to manage your freezes so they don't unfreeze, and you're skipping bosses! Okay. Alright. Okay. I disagree with that video game, but whatever. We'll do what you wanna do, like we always do. Alright. Come on, slide! Oh my gosh, okay. This screen, I was about to be like, this screen is fun and easy, and then like, went right in the pit. Alright, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Toad just wants to dance. Yes, he does, for sure. 
Alright, let's go. No drop of death. Whee! These rats are cute. Whoa! Ah! Okay. <laughs> that was so scary. It unfroze, but we didn't have to freeze again, so that's good. Flush it out. Oh! Here we go. Go, go, go. Bada bow do bow do bow do bow. Alright, here we go. Back D boost. Cool. Oh, man. This is a fun screen, also, to not get an unfreeze on. Wait. Let's go, Toad Man Arena. So, a lot of people fight him first, and they're like, Cause he's easy with Buster. You thought he was easy with Buster. <laughs> Just watch, it blows him up. Bow. Bow. So, one of the things about this uh, fight is that explosion from the drill causes lag. So if you're, like, moving around a lot while it's blowing up, you're going to slow down a little bit. So 20, like, uh, yeah, 29, 2009. Split out of there. Not super spicy. I think my PB is, like, a low 18, to put it in perspective. But sorry, right, I'm having a good old time. I hope you guys are, too. The boss is super easy, but optimizing the stage is super scary. Exactly. Even casually, it's a really hard stage. Like, people are like, I'm going to go do Toad first, because he's easy. But meanwhile, it's like this monster of a stage. So, alright, Cossack. So, fun fact. This is the first Mega Man game where Wily was not the boss. He's actually Dr. Cossack. So we're gonna have to go fight him. <laughs> Being a juicy boy. I'm always a juicy boy. It's on my sweatpants. Alright, here we go. One, two, three. Oh, no! So those slinkies are awful. They look like an enemy that, like, there's nothing to talk about. It's basically just a, a slinky. You know what I mean? But they deal a ton of damage, and they have a bunch of health, so it's just the worst. Oh, come on. Oh, okay. 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 This is good. Ooh, this is a pretty scary stage, to be honest. A lot of bad, goofy stuff can happen in here. Especially starting up here. Okay, let's go. Ooh, okay. Oh, okay. Let's walk on out. Jump. And go. Okay, good. Slinky is worst enemy ever. Yeah, I, I vote the turrets, man. Both versions of them. <laughs> like, they're, they're the worst. Free tank cab, the E-tank? Yeah, I skipped it. There's a free E-tank at the beginning of this stage, by the way, for those who did not know. You walk all the way back, and it's all the way in the back hiding there. But we're speedy boys, so we, we can't be taking E-tanks. I say that as I've, like, nearly game over a million times. But da da do Looking total what? I can't, my eyes are so, so bad. I'm <laughs> like... It's too tiny. I was at the store, like, yesterday. No, today, like, squinting at stuff. Good moth, thank you. Appreciate that. So, I don't know. <laughs> Sage, would... <sighs> I'm gonna pay some respect to Sage here, I think. No! Okay, I, I tried, Sage. I tried. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> I'm gonna take the ammo. You can do some really cool tech, but I messed up my balloon, so that's fine. This is a pretty scary screen. Normally you're supposed to take Rush Jet to get through this, but we're gonna be doing some spooky- Whoa! I disagree, again. I should've just done the crazy strats. <laughs> E-Tank didn't do anything. Do what your heart desires. Well, my heart led me astray and made me waste balloons, Sage. I don't know about that advice. <laughs> Good, thanks, Dabu. Oh, it's a ninja? Thanks! I would like to be a ninja at this game. I'm more like an awkward bird. Oh, no! Okay, please tell me I game over it so I don't have to worry about ammo. Or try to kill myself fast. God dang, <laughs> freaking video game! 
<laughs> it's like, no! Look at that. Look. Zero. I don't think I can make it, though. Oh my god. No! Okay, I was like, at least I'll get this. This will be cool. I didn't even get that. Because I am gonna- I am gonna game over. Let's do it. So, it's slow, probably. You could- I could- I could still do Rush Jet. Um, but the reason I decided to do that is because the balloon strats are really cool. So I'm just gonna do them. <laughs> yeah, I choke Yoda out, man. It's bad. But that's alright, that's alright. We're gonna make up for it with our, our looks and charm. This is what it looks like to be cute and fail at the same time. Alright. Let's do it right. Let's go. Oh, okay. Do, do, do. Let's go. Live with my shame, yes. No. I'm not very good at shame, I've tried. I don't know, I just... I did shame amateur, but I just don't think I could go pro. You know what I mean? And it's like, oh my god. I don't even know if I could pro this game. <laughs> Let's get into the dust dust fight. Oh. Alright, get the goofs out. Square Machine's a pretty hard boss. Well, it's he's annoying. We can beat him with one health. We're gonna have to take an extra cycle. Spike's cheap, that's what I'm saying. First try. That's right. Riley knows. Shouts to Riley. He was another he was another of my rivals. And Sage. So this guy is horribly just really bad with the RNG. He can either go by fast like that and then medium like this and then form right away. That's a three. He can go by medium and then form, that's a two. Or he can form right away, which is a one. A one is like obviously no the fastest thing. <laughs> Gear says let's go right as I die. One HP and an E tank in reserve. I had an E tank? When did I have the E tank? This is not good. Alright, let's go. Time to gold split all the rest of the game so I don't completely disrupt this event. I finished Final Fantasy with like 30 Mega Elixirs, yes. I have a juice box, yes. It's getting difficult to speedrun. I mean, yeah, but I mean, I'm, I'm playing pretty, pretty gross. That's alright. For now. As long as it's like, you know, it's, it's, it's still, I think, within the realm of being like, okay enough. <laughs> But, like, if I game over or play bad much longer, then it's gonna be like, alright, alright, Toad, wrap it up, wrap it up. We got a, we got an event to do here! Am I sure I played this game before? No, the other guy that was supposed to left, but... He left a few notes, so I decided to take him. Oh, I shot a little too early on that other one. Let's go. Two. Cool. Thanks for the faith, guys! I appreciate it. Let's go. Alright, he's dead! We did it. Now we go to Cossack 3. If you guys have uh, any donations you want to read, this is a good time. Finish the fight. Yes. Crack my knuckles and start. <laughs> yeah. No, I, I warmed up for a little bit, but I had a bunch of stuff going on at home today too, and like dad stuff. But I've been I've been playing and and working on some other stuff speed wise. But I did practice for a little bit. But that's a fair question. Maybe I should watch the tutorial. Yes. Do do do. Oh, here it is. We have a twenty-five dollar donation from Look at Toad's grandma. It says, Hi honey, why are you like this? Thanks, Look and Toad's grandma! Alright, so let's... Where's your cab at? <laughs> yeah, this is a cool song. Dead speedrunners now! I appreciate your guys' patience. I'm sure some of you are like... I don't appreciate your... your goof. Okay, this is a... It's a big old deal. And I agree, like, I don't mean any disrespect to the event by any means by playing poorly. It was my intention to play well, believe me. Believe me, I considered it even. I was like, maybe I should play bad for a change. Love you too, Graham. Yeah. Oh my god. 
Okay. Uh -huh. So, not too much you can do in this stage to go faster. There's some lag management you can do by trying to kill things right away and get these platforms off the screen really fast. So a lot of that involves, like, moving into them, like, right as they appear, so they die. Like this. Like, or not quite like that, but faster. That's the idea. Everyone wants to play while well, the game said no. No, I mean, we're try- we're trying! We really are. It's- it's- it can be a challenging game, but, um, very satisfying to play. Um, I totally recommend it to anyone that wants to play it. There's a tournament coming up, and if you've ever been concerning learning this game, you should definitely, definitely participate. No experience necessary. To have a good old time with your good old friends. Alright. This is a really cool fight. Oop. It's the same thing every time, kind of like Ring Man, kind of like Skull Man. Kill him with the top, and it goes down to the bottom. It's just so cool. Big ol' chef smooch off of that. Alright, there we go. Cool. And we're out. Beep. Mega Man games are no joke. It's true. It's very true. They're very hard, but very satisfying. That's how it often is, right? Like, the hardest strats are super fun to do, but, you know, they're a bummer when you mess them up. Good RNG? Yes, that we did get good RNG. It can shoot little bullets too, and they slow the screen down. So, it's not very good. Sage, I should have just brought you on for commentary. So you, <laughs> so you can be like, also, there's a video game, you guys. It's also interesting. Oh, I hate that. Sometimes you just land right in front of it. Um, so this is actually a pretty mellow stage, all things considered. Um, Compared to the other ones. Cossack 1 and 2 are pretty challenging. Cossack 3 is kind of like, oh, what? How did I not get off of that? Cossack 3 is kind of a breather. And then this one is also a little bit of a breather before you kind of pick it back up a little bit Wily. But I would say that the Cossack 2, I mean, not, not Wily, he's not in this game. Um, <laughs> um, based, the later stages in the game are hard. <laughs> Um, but this is a pretty, pretty chill stage. This boss is also affected very weirdly by sliding. You can, like, slide to control its movement. Alright, oh, here we go. Well, good, I'm glad you guys, <laughs> I'm glad you guys are having a good time. Alright, so, switch on over to Buster. We're playing Mega Man 4, so he's not gonna move, and this is the big difference between Mega Man 4 and Rockman 4, is that Mega Man 4... He won't move at the start of the fight, he'll just kind of wait for a sec. And then in Rockman 4, he moves right away. Um, I'm not sure why that is, but that's just how it is. I actually prefer Rockman 4, just because I feel like it's easier to control his movement with your sliding and stuff if he moves right away. It just feel a little silly. You have to wait. But, oh, what's this? Who's that? Is that Roll? No, please make a man dope. My father is not really evil. Dr. Wily, oh! Oh, daughter, oh! Oh, it's bad, man. I'm gonna break you, Mega Man. Literally, I am going to break you, Mega Man. <laughs> I want to scream that at my enemies. Get these eyebrows. I got Dr. I, I have Dr. R. Wily eyebrows in real life. What do you mean you won't accept my return? I will break you, Best Buy. Get sued. Immediately. I know, right? It's insane. It's insane. It's Wily. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? But we gotta deal with it, I guess. Because he's just kidnapping folks. We can't have that. It's not good. So, as you will be able to notice very quickly, this is the Met stage. Everybody is a Met, which is pretty cute. You'll never guess what the boss is, though. It's about as surprising as Wily being the bad guy in this game. Whoa! That was a little early. That's fine. Beat him up, Dr. Wily. Yes. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Dr. Wily. 
I was actually just talking with someone about Mega Man 8. I think it was wait, was it you wait? Who was it <laughs> about how there's that part in Mega Man where that robot is like squeezing him and he's like yelling. One time I heard that part off screen and it was like I was I, I wasn't watching, but I was just hearing that part and I was like, wow, this goes on forever. Like who decided to make this like last so long? Mega Man just yelling. Here we go. This is Metal Daddy. Appropriately named. He is the daddy of Mets. Be nice to me, Met Daddy. Oh! No, Met Daddy, that's not nice. Don't freeze me inside you. Oh no, I should have blocked. Oh, I, oh, this is goofy. Oh no, I'm dead. Pff, oh my god, dude. Don't laugh at me, Gare. <laughs> you don't- you're not allowed. You don't play this game. No, I'm just kidding. Metman Papa, it was you! You're the one who's doing this to my run. I blame Metman immediately. Everybody turn on him. I know, waiter, I'm sorry. Okay, look, we have lives. Okay, now we're now we're slowly slipping into the threshold of like, okay, this is like you gotta be fast. Otherwise we're gonna throw everybody off. So I apologize to people who are trying to play this game play in this event. They have to, they have to go after me. Mad Mega, I'm sorry man. Oh god, here we go. Laughing at Mega Man I know! I know. It's too late, Gear. Can't be making excuses. Orb. That's different. That's some some Mario. You playing those Mario Brothers. All right, here we go. Oh, whoa! Sorry, you guys. I forgot my game genie. So as you can see, if he hits the ground while you are on it, it will freeze you and you won't be able to move. It's good to take hits off of the Mets instead of the big Met. Um, because they deal way less damage than Met Daddy himself, as you saw before when he stepped on me a lot. Okay. Doing great, brother. Thanks, Met. <laughs> I appreciate it. Oh, man. If this was GDQ, Mad Mega would just be like, I'll come up on the stage, but like, give me that controller. Jeez, just finish it for me. Like, all right, I'm sorry, man. I respect. Still an orb, yes. This is the dog stage. I call it the dog stage because you use Rush a lot. So, it's pretty clever, really, if you ask me. Very, very, very good name. Okay, walk on this dude. Now we're gonna switch to our dog. Oh boy, he's a good boy. So you can only, you can only fire bullets when Rush is on the screen. So it makes screens like this a little tricky. Cause you have to, oh, get hit by stuff. And Rush is just like, sorry man. All right, here we go. All right, oh. But he's a good boy though, he helps. Like with this jump. Help me rush. Yeah. See if we get the strat. See if we get the strat. Oh yeah. Well, it, it could have been better, but shout outs to Hypa. Hypa strat. Bubba barrel. Get the skull. Maybe we'll get the super sick strat in this next screen. You guys will love it. You'll love it. Here we, oh no. No, okay. Here we go. It's in the- Oh! Uh, 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 okay, it's in this screen. Let's see if we get it. No. Oh man. He has to shoot the red ball. You can get this really cool looking weird strat. But I will show you guys this strat. It's faster to fight him with the ring. Or, or like, with it, you know. Okay, so we're. At, uh, words. Okay, so we're gonna jump in and use Toad. Okay. Then we're gonna switch to Drill. Hit him with that. Disables his hitbox. And walk inside of him. And I have no ring. Cool. What's his other weakness? It's like dust, right? Does someone here play this game? 
Does someone here know that? <laughs> Does someone here play this game? Can you help me, please? Now you're laughing at me? That's fair. Alright. We're getting out of here. Ooh, 39. Okay, yeah, guys. Okay. I gotta be fast. Gotta be fast. Gotta go fast. Google. <laughs> Is soft weakness. Sorry, you guys. I came really unprepared. I really... Normally, I have my game genie, but I just... I don't know. I left it at Grandma's house. That's why she doesn't like it. That I play this game. I'm like, look, Grandma, I am really good at a game from 1991. And I think I deserve all the respect that that entails. Get up and leave the room. Flippantly. Love. Aw, thank you. But no, I like this game. I think speedrunning's the best. It's maybe excellent timing, actually, is it? Alright, so I take Dust into Pharaoh. Um, it's not his weakness, but it hurts him faster than Buster, and faster than his weakness, which is the Flash Stopper, which is great. It just, it's the only boss that gets frozen in place by it. But we use it against him, it's pretty fast, and we can take it right away into Skull, which is his weakness. So. We'll just go right into here and take him out, Let's see what kind of shield he gives us. Okay, pretty bad one. It's not very good. Okay, get over into school. Nice Pharaoh, thanks. Alright. Yeah, okay. Okay. That was weird, but this is fine. So, you defeat him with his weakness, and you come into Bright with Skull, which is a little goofy, but you hit him with it an odd number of times, and it sets his values, his HP values, to values where he will never freeze you. Um, he only freezes at 16, 8, and 4 health. So that's really good to know. If you are going in against him with Toad, like casually, because you did Toad first, if you shoot him with one lemon before you start using Toad, that will ensure he won't freeze you. If you're using Buster, three charges, one normal, all the rest charges. So there you go. So let's see what he wants to do. Of course. He's like, oh, you're behind time? You know, it'd be hilarious. If I die. Wanna see something cool, Mega Man? Alright, here we go. Moving on over to Toad. Who's weak to drill. Bump. Poor Toad. Unfortunately, I believe he's, like, programmed to jump when you shoot, like, to your location. Or if he's dancing, it just stops him, and he's like, alright. Here we go. Cool. Alright, here we go. Let's get out of here. Don't be a jerk, you dingus. Ah, you did it. Decided to suck. Alright, this is fine. Go, get out of here. Alright, you guys. We're on our way out. We gotta fight Wily Machine. Cool trick that's also easy to do casually. Get him to 1 HP, and then hit him with a drill. And it will skip the life fill of the next form. And then the next drill you do do double damage. And I'm pretty sure the way this works is that you're hurting the second form with the explosion of the drill, like while you're killing the first form, like that. So it hurts it, makes the life go up, and then you get the damage from the first drill, uh, and the second one. So he's dead. A lot of people know the infamous used toad bullet as he's leaving, and then you're just stuck here forever. 
Why does he have the same voice as Morty? I don't know. Oh, gee, I can't. I, I can't do Morty. I can do Jigglypuff. <clears throat> you guys want to hear Jigglypuff? Do Jigglypuff pretty good. And Kirby. You can do Kirby pretty good. Good fight. Thank you. Thank you. Let's do it. So, just a quick little hallway. If you've ever had to grind these caterpillars for ammo, it is the worst thing. I think you will, you will have noticed. So you come in here with pretty low ammo. It's pretty scary. If you're fast, you can get these double hits in one cycle, which is really good. You can get it. That's it! Boom! Uh, stop the timer! 44.50. Only two, almost three minutes over estimate. Can I do meat wad? Squid can. Squid wad. A kind of can. Kirby sucks. Hi. Thanks for the GGs. I appreciate it. Okay, we're very entertaining. I'm glad. I'm glad it wasn't just like, you know. <laughs> At least it hopefully was somewhat entertaining to balance out the wackness, but... Alright, well, we're gonna throw it over to Mad Mega here. Um, again, I'll plug real fast the tournament. Um, come learn Mega Man 4, it's amazing. Um, the, uh, there's info in the Classic Mega Discord, if you wanna check that out, it's really good. Come learn Mega Man and hang out and play with us. And thanks for the GG's, and thanks for having me. Yes, Hi. Yes, we, we do, we do. Alright, cool. Alright guys, uh, thanks again, and I will... Check you later.